Hey guys, how you? How's it going today? It's uh, Mr. Gagnon. I am going to give you guys a uh, a supplemental video here to talk about the um, what we're going to call momentum. Um, of a system. of objects you know up until this point we've looked at momentum uh, um, with one object um, but in, in real life there's more than just one object um, acting at any particular point in time and we can add momentum as vectors uh, the good thing is that we won't have to get into uh, two-dimensional um, uh, momentum, um, you know, such as like uh, billiard balls, like hitting each other and moving off at different directions. Uh, we're going to look at just straight <clears throat> linear systems. So um, let's just write out the formula for it. Uh, the P of a, uh, or momentum of a system, uh, we'll call it the uh, sum of momentum. Okay, so the momentum of a system is momentum 1 plus momentum 2 uh, plus momentum 3 and then uh, dot, dot, dot. Uh, and we can also go a little bit further and say that uh, we know that it's mass 1, velocity 1 plus mass 2, velocity 2 plus mass 3, velocity 3, dot, dot, dot. Because we learned earlier that momentum is uh, the uh, mass times the velocity in that direction. Now, we've got to just decide on, a, uh, it, on the momentum of a system. Uh, let's use our current terminology in that um, if there is something moving uh, this way, Okay, we'll call it a uh, positive momentum. If something's moving uh, this way, we'll call it negative momentum. Um, so when you have the plural of momentum, you can say, um, <laughs> you might want to be tempted to say momentums, uh, but it's not. It's actually momenta. Okay, so um, let's just look at one problem here. Okay, let's say we do, did have two billiard balls. Um, here's your example. Okay, let's say your, your first billiard ball uh, had a mass of uh, two, let's say uh, it's a pretty large billiard ball, uh, two kilograms uh, going to the right at two meters a second. And then, <clears throat> and then another uh, billiard ball that's coming out uh, this way, uh, we'll say it's uh, 2.5 kilograms and it's going 2 meters a second. So if, um, if this billiard ball were to stick to this one, okay, it becomes a, um, uh, a single system. So let's just look at the total momentum of the system. P system equals M1 V1 plus M2, V2. All right, so it looks like we're going to be calling this one negative and this one positive because it is a vector. Um, so it equals to uh, 2 kilograms. That's 2 meters a second plus 2.5 uh, kilograms um, times negative 2 meters a second. So if we have um, if we have four here minus um, five here, okay, the total momentum of the system, you know, hopefully you can see that okay, is uh, negative one kilogram meters per second. Okay, so that's the total momentum of the system. It is uh, saying that it is in a um, a leftward or westward direction. Um, and that is how to calculate the, the momentum of the system.